What's going on everybody? Today we are here at the Corvette Bash 2022. It started yesterday. Yesterday was my birthday, so I had to come out here and check it out. And everybody, it did not disappoint. We have the 2023 Z06. I'm gonna show you that here in a minute, but the 2023 Z06, the Z07 package. We also have just your standard Z06 as well. Then we have the 70th anniversary both the uh, white pearl uh, tricoat metallic, and then we have your carbon flash, which is basically black. And so, um, yeah, I probably, let's go ahead and show you the man of the hour right now. Mr. Z06 with the Z07 package. This is a beautiful car, everybody. So this car is actually three and a half, no, excuse me, 3.6 inches wider than the normal stingray and so it's that's because of those big massive 345 in the rear 275s up front and um these 335s excuse me these 345s are michelin pilot sport cup 2rs a specially compounded tire made specifically for the z06 let let me do something real quick i'm a I'm about to show y'all something real quick. Uh, I have pretty big feet, at least I think so. I have size, I have size 13 shoes. <laughs> so take a look at that size 13 shoe. There is actually still, yeah, this tire is wider than a 13 inch shoe. So just to give you some perspective on that. And so you have this beautiful carbon fiber wing. Look at that, so, so beautiful. That, that, that weave on there is just, it's immaculate. Then you also hear you have the new blacked out exhaust tips. That is now a, an option. But this particular car, this particular car has the, <clears throat> excuse me, the stealth package. If you take a look at there, it's uh, from what Harlan said earlier today, it's in case people don't really care for the bevels that are kind of a silver or a brushed nickel. Um, you have these to kind of subdue that and make it a little bit more stealth, which I actually love. It looks like if you just look at it, it actually looks like it's black chrome. Here you have the carbon fiber wheels. Now these assist in reducing the unsprung weight by 41 pounds. And a lot of people ask, well, what does that unsprung weight mean? So that's everything that is not supported by the suspension. And so that would be your tires, excuse me, that would be your wheels, your hub, your control arms. And with that reduction in unsprung weight, it allows the car to be able to react to imperfections in the road a lot more quickly. So it makes it more agile and things of that nature. Here up front, you have this beautiful, it looks like a three-piece splitter. Then you have the canards on each side. And then you have three heat exchangers up front and then two uh, on the side for a total of five. So this car is freaking money.
So if you check right here, everybody, you got the dog on uh, stealth package. It looks kind of like a black chrome if you take a look at it. You can kind of see here. Uh, and Harlan was actually saying earlier that they did it in case you want to make it a little bit more subdued because a lot of people didn't like the nickel um, just kind of not blending in or just kind of being bright. And so you could go ahead and get that. Um, let me see. There are some other components that are part of the uh, stealth package. This right here, that's part of the stealth package. This right here. And you can see this has the carbon fiber package as well. Um, it has a bit more carbon fiber in it than other, you know, trim levels and things of that nature. So this is actually something that I would do on mine, uh, but I'm not getting one. And so, yeah, so this is pretty, this is pretty nice. All right, over here, you have the 70th anniversary edition. You have both the carbon flash and then you have the white pearl metallic tricoat or tricoat metallic over there and these you can tell that they are 70th anniversary editions not only by the color scheme but only these cars will have the 70th on the flags uh, within here you got kind of two set setups you got this um, ceramic white interior it almost looks like cool gray but cool gray was discontinued and so, but it is called ceramic white. And then you have these subtle uh, racing stripes that is satin um, that looks really good. I mean, it doesn't stand out or anything like that, but a lot of people, uh, they like that. They have the blacked out tips as well that uh, they have not had before. All right, so here you have the white pearl uh, tricoat metallic. You got the satin gray um, stripes on here, which are beautiful. This is the 70th anniversary edition. That's something about pearl that just, I'm not sure if you can get that, but it's just that, that beautiful shimmery kind of I don't know. It's just beautiful. Uh, hopefully you can see that kind of shimmer on it. Oops, excuse me. This is the silver flare, if I'm not mistaken. Very nice, very nice. Oops, excuse me. Oh, uh, then you have the full adrenaline red interior. Dipped adrenaline red. If you like red, then uh, this is your car for sure. Everybody, that's it. That's all that we have time for today. So thank you guys for coming back to the channel, checking out these beautiful cars. Uh, if you, if you are lucky enough to get your hands on one of these, God bless you. Me, I'm gonna be waiting to see what we got in store for the Zora and the ZR1, depending on which one comes out or if either both of them comes out. But either way, uh, I'm gonna wait until that comes out before I make a decision on what exactly I'm gonna get. So hopefully by the time the ZR1 and them come out or is available, it might be a little bit easier to get your hand on one of these uh, Z06s. So everybody, thank you guys for coming to the channel. If you like the video, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button. If you like the channel, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell notification button so each and every time I put out a video, you'll be notified. And as always, everybody, remember, everyone deployed. And I'm out.